Maddie Mathers and chef and host of Vicelands at Suppertime. Yeah. Maddie, how are you? Yeah, how are you? So, you're going to make us a cheeseburger. Let's get started. And while you're making it, tell me how long you've been doing it and how you perfected it. How? Oh, well, I'm going to make a cheeseburger by first starting the meat grinder. The meat grinder. Do you guys like meat grinders and burgers? So, burgers, the most important thing. I've been making cheeseburgers for a minute. Yeah. I made a video like five years ago for Vice, and then they started Vice Land. That's how I kind of got a show. But the most important thing, who cares about that stuff? Vice is sick, whatever. <laughs> so, but the thing you want to make sure is to grind your own beef. Okay. Buying store bought ground beef, you don't know when it was ground, you don't know where it came from. Botulisms, you know, you cook at a weird yeah. temperature. Great. Nobody wants that. So we got to grind our own beef, everyone. Get a meat grinder. Okay. Meat grinder, fairly affordable, a meat grinder? <laughs> yeah. Great. Who's got. Seven, five hundred bucks? Oh, okay, good. Maybe not. No, it's I, loud. It's loud. So you just take beef, which is like brisket or short. Great. Whatever, short rib. And a secret, is it too loud? No, it's great. Okay. So, okay. Oh. Fresh beef. Fresh beef. And the best thing about grinding fresh beef. Oh my God. Okay. Well, that's right, too great. loud. That's fresh Who beef. Who cares? Okay, so that's too loud. But you want to make sure that your beef. Okay, it's kind of half frozen when you okay. Okay. When you grind it, because then it makes it easier to grind. Okay, great. So now we have a good ratio of fat and beef. You okay, that is a good ratio. I don't that's usually a good ratio. see. Well, I you eat a lot of fat. And no, beef. I don't usually see a patty with that much fat in it, but I'm no. kind of super psyched about it. So then you just kind of bounce it around your hand and you, you form it into a patty. Uh -huh. You want to make sure that you treat your burgers unlike meatballs. You don't stuff them with onions or Worcestershire or ketchup or put any of that stuff in there. All you want to do. It's treated like a steak, so salt and pepper. Okay. I'm not really seasoned. I'm kind of okay. you know, a wild dog here. No, that's great. Okay. Live your life. Oh, just raw beef everywhere. Oh, great. So make sure you have raw beef everywhere. That's excellent. That's nice. Yeah, it's great to that's have raw nice. beef around. We're going to wash your hands later. We're going to do it later. Nothing on this. It's just a hot cast iron. Hot cast iron, because there is enough beef fat right. in here that's going to render out. Okay. And that's another thing. If you put a bunch of oil in there, then it's going to get greasy. Uh huh. That's As we're I doing this, so the big thing we got beef, we have cheese, we have condiment, and we need buns. So can you butter buns? Yep. Seth likes to butter buns. Hey. We're going to watch him butter some buns. I you told you to that in this. confidence. We got two right. minutes. Let's so keep just going. go like that? Yeah, go like that and put it in the pan. Okay, great. And we're going to make almost like. When what kind of buns are we making? What kind of buns are these? These are milk buns. So milk buns are really great. They turn into almost like donuts. They get warm, they get great. smushy. Nice. It's like a beef donut. Have you ever had a beef donut? Uh, I haven't had a beef donut. I didn't know they exist. They oh exist. Oh my God. We're making one right now, sir. Really? <laughs> what are you doing there? I'm making condiment. Yeah, I know, but like why? special sauce. So we just make all the sauces. Okay. Ketchup. So the special sauce is just the main Mayonnaise. three sauces? Yeah. Okay. You take the, con the three greatest condiments, make it into one condiment. Okay, great. And then the thing I want you to do move your cards. Okay, great. So then we got <laughs> pickles. Put pickles in there. Mm -hmm. So we want crunch. We want acid, a little more pickles. Great. So nice. Great. Now cut an onion. Great. We've got to put cheese on this burger. We are moving along. I'm going to flip this around. Um, and that... look at all the fat coming off of that. Do I dice it more, or is this a good cut? Yeah, dice it. OK, great. Well, give and it so, a dice. Uh, and you, so you're showing uh, Vice, it's supper time. Uh, do you like doing your show? I love doing my show. My show's like you. You do your show. I do my show. It's That's very a... nice. Yep. It's a good show. I want to steam the cheese. This steam the cheese? Yeah, just a little bit of water, okay. steaming. Is that enough onion for the That's sauce? That's enough. Add it to the condiment. I'm going to, the condiment. And now am I going to stir it? Yeah, give it a stir. Okay, Let's, great. And we're steaming the cheese, oh, so it's I'm really so nice. I'm so excited about this. Oh, and cheeseburger is a nice time for everyone. I am a little concerned about the fact that you're only making one burger. I hope well, you, you know I'm going to eat it. You can have a, a bite. A bite? So put your condiment on both sides. So we have three components. We have a beef. We got the cheese is really important. Good beef. Cheese. Can you say? Great. Condiment on the bottom. Steam cheese burger. Oh my goodness. Don't eat this because it's raw. <laughs> wow. Okay. Is it too raw? Can I eat it? You can. Yeah, we just ground it. It's fresh. Maybe eat. Yeah, take Maybe a bite. Wait. You can eat that one. We're fine. I'll eat some ground beef. Hold on. I want to see how raw it is. Oh, it's too raw. No. It's too raw. No, it's too raw. That's too okay, raw. Too raw. Eat that one! That's how you make cheeseburgers! Season <laughs> 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 <laughs>